Welcome to Three Minute Theology. Now, have you ever wondered, where was Jesus in the Old Testament? Sometimes I think, like, was Jesus just sitting in a green room waiting for the opening pages of Matthew so he could come in the incarnation? Well, no. One of the truths that we know about scripture, that scripture teaches us, is that Jesus was active and working even throughout the Old Testament. I want to give you two examples. The first one is Exodus 3.2. There's this phrase that's used throughout the Old Testament called the angel of the Lord. And there's a big question, who is the angel of the Lord? Well, there's an indication that the angel of the Lord may actually be Jesus himself. Why? Because when Moses comes up to the burning bush, he does two things that are so incredible. One, he takes off his sandals because he acknowledges that the burning bush um, is a holy space. Second, he bows down and he gives worship, right? Now, interesting, Exodus 3, 2, the text says that inside of the burning bush was whom? The angel of the Lord. Now, if this isn't convincing enough, there is another Old Testament passage, Psalm 110. And this is a throne room scene. King David um, enters into a vision. He kind of sees uh, God. And this is what he sees. He says, he, he begins to uh, talk about a conversation. He says, um, the Lord says to my Lord, sit at my right hand until I make your enemies your footstool. Well, a couple important things. One is the first Lord in Hebrew is Yahweh, the intimate name of the Lord. The second Lord is Adonai, which is a general term to describe a king or a ruler. Now, first, we know that Yahweh is not talking to David because David is observing this conversation. And secondly, why would Yahweh be talking to another Lord? And why would he say to this other Lord to sit at my right hand until I make all of your enemies a Footstool. This is an important word. Well, Jesus in the New Testament helps us out. In Matthew twenty-two forty-four, 44, Jesus quotes King David in Psalm 110. And he says, the Lord said to my Lord, sit at my right hand until I put your enemies under your feet. Really interesting. The Greek text of, the, uh, of Matthew twenty-two twenty-four 24 says, Curios to curio, which means the Lord said to my Lord. Actually, Jesus is quoting the Hebrew Bible translated into Greek right here. The Lord said to my Lord. This is an indication right off the bat that Jesus acknowledges his own presence in the Old Testament and that even King David had an idea that this was going to take place. This is why Jesus quotes Psalm 110 and we see it through even the original language. Now, the footstool word is really, really important. The only other time the phrase the footstool is used in the Old Testament is referring to the Ark of the Covenant. Well, what is the Ark of the Covenant associated with? God himself. There's an association with the Messiah, with Jesus, with the Ark of the Covenant, the temple, the Holy of Holies. And so we see Jesus in the Old Testament.